home. From transporting hazardous materials to potential catastrophic damage, tank trucks pose significant risks on our roads. When a tank truck encounters an accident, the situation can quickly escalate from a routine road incident to a disaster of immense proportions. Now, don't forget to press the like button, subscribe and comment what do you think for these amazing moments. Tank trucks are specialized vehicles playing a vital role in transporting liquids and gases across vast distances, supporting industries and supplying essential resources. When these vehicles are involved in accidents, the consequences will be catastrophic, affecting lives, the environment and infrastructure. A tanker truck exploded in Bologna, Italy. The blast caused part of a motorway bridge to collapse, with several people wounded by debris and shattered glass. On October 7, 2015, a tanker was damaged when it flipped over guardrails and exploded on the New Jersey Turnpike on the Western Spur in Kearney on October 7, 2015. October 2022, in a harrowing incident near a railway line in Mexico, a fuel tanker driver lost control, resulting in a catastrophic crash with devastating consequences. As the tanker hurtled toward the railway line, the driver's desperate attempt to regain control proved futile. The impact of the collision caused a violent rupture, instantly releasing a massive quantity of highly flammable fuel. The spilled fuel ignited, engulfing the surrounding area in an intense and rapidly spreading blaze. The inferno posed an immediate threat to nearby structures, vegetation and the railway line itself. The fuel tanker crash near the railway line left a trail of destruction, underscoring the grave risks associated with transporting hazardous materials and the vital importance of stringent safety measures to prevent such catastrophic incidents. The explosion occurred Sunday, August 18th, after a fuel tanker lost control and rammed into three cars on a highway between the capital Kampala and Kazazi town near the border with Democratic Republic of Congo. Lethal traffic accidents frequently happen in the region, where roads are often narrow and potholed. Flames tore through around 25 nearby shops. Don't forget to press the like button, subscribe and comment what do you think of these catastrophic damages. In a devastating incident on Long Island, a tanker truck crash sparked a massive fire, unleashing chaos and destruction in its wake. The tanker carrying a highly flammable substance, causing a catastrophic rupture and the immediate ignition of its contents. Within moments, a towering inferno engulfed the surrounding area, sending plumes of thick black smoke billowing into the sky. As the fire raged on, emergency responders raced to the scene, battling the towering flames and working tirelessly to evacuate residents and control the situation. The incident serves as a stark reminder of the dangers associated with hazardous material transportation and the critical importance of robust safety measures to prevent such catastrophic events.
In a horrifying incident on a Maryland highway, a tanker truck overturned, triggering a fiery crash that engulfed vehicles and homes in a relentless inferno. The tanker, carrying a substantial load of flammable material, lost control, causing it to overturn and rupture upon impact. Within seconds, the spilled substance ignited, sending billowing flames and thick plumes of black smoke into the air. The relentless heat and flames posed a grave threat to surrounding structures, resulting in significant damage to homes and nearby infrastructure. In a catastrophic accident on I-95, a tanker truck collided with another vehicle, resulting in the devastating spillage of approximately 9,000 gallons of fuel. The force of the crash caused the tanker to rupture, unleashing an uncontrollable torrent of highly flammable liquid onto the highway. The spilled fuel rapidly spread across the road, creating a hazardous and volatile environment. Video shows a tanker truck engulfed in flames following a crash on an Arkansas highway. Hope all escaped in Jesus' name. Amen. A fuel tanker carrying around 8,000 gallons of fuel was punctured Sunday morning, leaking hundreds of gallons of unleaded gasoline in Phoenix. So terrible. Two tanker trucks collided, exploded, and caught fire in Phoenix sending huge clouds of black smoke over a wide area of the southeast metro area and prompting evacuations. Torquay is a coastal town located in Devon, England, known for its marina and boating activities. It attracts luxury yachts and super yachts, offering a range of services and facilities for yacht owners and visitors. The boat, an 85-foot princess which is thought to be worth six million pounds, reportedly drifted out into the harbor after the fire broke out on board and the rope securing it to the pier burnt through. You can see thick plumes of black smoke pouring from the vessel into the sky. The incident had caused traffic blocks in both directions along Torbay Road. Lake Powell is one of the largest reservoirs in the United States. It's situated within the Glen Canyon National Recreation Area, spanning the border between Arizona and Utah. The lake is surrounded by stunning red rock cliffs, canyons and mesas, showcasing the unique geology of the region. It's situated within the Colorado Plateau, known for its rugged landscapes and striking geological formations. June 7th. A video of the flames could be seen from a distance as a dock of boats caught fire. It happened on Lake Powell in Arizona. A business owner who was nearby said he used a garden hose to try and put out the flames until firefighters arrived. About 10 houseboats burned for roughly 90 minutes. A witness said, as the fire was coming up, the wind was blowing the fire almost sideways. Andiamo is a luxury yacht built by the Italian shipyard, Benetti. It measures approximately 197 feet in length and boasts an elegant and modern design. The Andiamo yacht fire was a notable incident that occurred on November 16, 2020 in Miami, Florida. The fire broke out while the Andiamo yacht was docked at Island Gardens Marina in Miami, a popular destination for luxury yachts. The fire quickly engulfed the yacht, causing thick plumes of smoke to rise into the air. Firefighters worked diligently to control and extinguish the fire, battling both the flames and the challenges posed by the yacht's size and complexity. Their efforts focused on protecting nearby vessels and preventing the fire from spreading further. Despite the firefighters' efforts, the Andiamo yacht sustained significant damage from the fire. The intense flames and the efforts to extinguish them resulted in visible structural damage. A 
particularly to the yacht's upper decks and superstructure. Don't forget to press the like button, subscribe and comment what do you think of these yacht fires. Princess Yachts is a renowned British luxury yacht manufacturer known for its high quality vessels, bridge yachts and super yachts, renowned for their craftsmanship, design and performance. And this is its fire in 2019. Marina Castella is a marina located in Castella, Croatia and is known for its scenic location along the Adriatic Sea. It provides berthing and facilities for yachts and boats, attracting sailors and boating enthusiasts from around the world. Five 20-meter boats were completely destroyed and 18 were damaged on Saturday night at Marina Castella. The fire started around 8.30 p.m. on one of the yachts in the marina. Crew members attempted to put out the fire but were unsuccessful. A witness said that it was terrible. I've never seen a fire like this before. That yacht caught fire and unfortunately it ended up completely in flames. Everyone scattered in all directions and believe me, it looked like a state of war. People were screaming, jumping for help and then it suddenly grew even larger. That burning ship broke free from where it was moored and the flames quickly engulfed the other yachts. Plastic was burning and the oil derivatives in them as well probably. So, it's not surprising that there was so much black smoke. Luckily, no one was hurt, but damages reached into the millions of dollars. Lady Christine is a luxury yacht built by the Dutch shipyard Feedship. It measures approximately 68 meters, 223 feet in length and features a sleek and elegant design. The super yacht Lady Christine caught fire while docked in West Palm Beach, Florida that occurred in February 2016. The fire started in the early hours of the morning and the crew on board immediately alerted emergency services. Firefighters and local authorities responded to the scene to combat the fire and ensure the safety of those on board. The Lady Christine yacht sustained significant damage from the fire. The upper decks and interior areas of the yacht were heavily affected and smoke and fire damage were visible. <laughs> Mission Bay is situated in the western part of San Diego, bordered by the Pacific Ocean to the west and the neighborhoods of Pacific Beach and Mission Beach to the north. It's renowned for its stunning bay, beautiful beaches and a variety of recreational opportunities. A massive fire burned for hours on Tuesday, March 11, 2014 at a construction site in San Francisco's Mission Bay neighborhood. The blaze overtook a building under construction that's due to become a 360-unit apartment complex. The fire was first reported at 4.56 p.m. local time and about 150 firefighters responded to the scene. San Francisco Fire Department officials said the fire was more difficult to contain because the building is under construction and the building's fire suppression systems had not been completely installed. Grenfell Tower was situated within the Lancaster West Estate, a council housing complex in North Kensington. The tower stood prominently on Lancaster West Road, near the intersection with Bramley Road. The tower was part of a densely populated urban area characterized by a mix of residential, commercial and 
agricultural facilities. The immediate vicinity included other residential buildings, schools, community centers, and local amenities. On June 14, 2017, an emergency call from London Council Housing Grenfell Tower reported a small fire on the fourth floor of the building. 36 minutes later, the fire climbed to the top of the 24-story building. While residents called for help from within, family members and neighbors watched in horror from the street. Unbelievable. A government inquiry later found that the outside of the building had been fitted with highly combustible cladding, which led to the fire spreading quickly and left residents trapped. Had this been known, the property would have been evacuated and lives saved. So sad. Now, don't forget to press the like button, subscribe, and comment about what do you think of this catastrophic failure. The famous Las Vegas Strip is a stretch of Las Vegas Boulevard South, lined with numerous hotels, casinos, resorts, and entertainment venues. It's a bustling and vibrant area known for its bright lights and iconic architecture. The Boardwalk Apartment Fire was a significant incident that occurred in Las Vegas, Nevada in December 2011. The apartment complex was a three-story building consisting of multiple units. The fire broke out inside one of the units, quickly spreading to other parts of the building. Emergency services, including firefighters and paramedics, were dispatched to the scene to combat the blaze and ensure the safety of the residents. The fire and subsequent damage resulted in the displacement of numerous residents who were unable to return to their homes. The Notre Dame Cathedral is located in the heart of Paris, the capital city of France. The cathedral is renowned for its architectural beauty and historical significance. The Notre Dame Cathedral fire occurred on April 15, 2019, in Paris, France. The fire started in the late afternoon, engulfing the cathedral's roof and spire. It rapidly spread due to the cathedral's wooden framework, which dated back to the 13th century. The fire caused significant damage to the cathedral's roof and spire. The iconic spire, constructed in the 19th century, collapsed during the blaze, leaving behind a gaping hole in the roof. The Notre Dame Cathedral fire remains a poignant reminder of the vulnerability of architectural treasures and the need for continued efforts to safeguard them for future generations. Trump Tower is located in the heart of Manhattan, New York City, United States. It's situated in the Midtown Manhattan neighborhood, which is known for its bustling streets, iconic landmarks, luxury shops, and vibrant atmosphere. The fire took place at Trump Tower, a prominent high-rise building located at 721 Fifth Avenue in Manhattan, New York City. The fire broke out on the 50th floor of the building. The blaze started in an apartment and quickly spread due to the building's construction, which included concrete with limited fireproofing on the floors. After the fire was extinguished, an investigation was conducted to determine the cause. It was concluded that the fire was accidental and resulted from an electrical issue in the apartment's power strips and electrical cords.
And this is another landing on Grand Parkway when the plane experienced a problem with their power system. Video captured the moment a single-engine plane was failed on landing and forced to make an emergency landing on the 91 freeway in Southern California. Luckily, no one was hurt. A tanker smashes into a bridge linking Osaka's Kansai Airport with the mainland after Typhoon Jebai makes landfall on Tuesday. The ship had been anchored but was forced into the bridge by the strongest storm to hit Japan for 25 years. In a shocking incident, a massive ship collided with a bridge, resulting in a catastrophic event that left onlookers stunned. The force of the collision caused significant damage to both the ship and the bridge, resulting in a chaotic scene of twisted metal, debris and potential structural instability. A Russian cargo ship hits a road bridge in Busan, South Korea. The Korea Coast Guard said the 5,998-ton Sea Grand hit the Gwangan Bridge before turning around. No injuries were reported, but the bridge was closed for safety checks. Some footage of heavy equipment fail driving at work. A common issue is brake failure, which results in an inability to stop or slow down the heavy equipment properly. This can be caused by worn brake components, hydraulic system failures or malfunctioning brake systems. Overheating or mechanical breakdowns can also occur and result in the equipment becoming inoperable or experiencing a sudden loss of power. The pilot was flying with a customer who was about to buy a vintage plane when it suddenly lost power as it approached Spruce Creek Airport. He was forced to make an emergency landing on a Florida highway during a routine check flight. A short circuit holds the potential for catastrophic consequences and when it involves a high voltage power line, the danger becomes even more pronounced. A blinding flash of light accompanied by an explosive sound marks the point of contact where the short circuit occurs. The sudden release of immense power causes a dramatic increase in temperature and a rapid expansion of gases, leading to a violent and visually captivating display. The sound of the short circuit echoes like a thunderclap, reverberating through the air and sending shockwaves of fear through witnesses. What would you do if you encountered this situation on the road? A significant incident took place in 2016 when a freight train derailed and caused the partial collapse of a railroad bridge in Georgetown, Texas. The derailment occurred due to a track misalignment, which resulted in several rail cars falling off the bridge and damaging its structure. The incident caused significant disruptions to rail operations and required substantial efforts to repair the bridge and restore normal train services.
Losing an anchor poses big risks to the ship and its crew. It results in reduced maneuverability, making it challenging to maintain position or safely navigate in certain areas. The loss of an anchor impacts the ship's ability to safely moor or secure itself, particularly in port areas where anchoring is essential for stability. Ship operators typically initiate procedures to retrieve or replace the anchor promptly. This may involve using specialized equipment, divers, or assistance from other vessels to recover the lost anchor or install a replacement. left wing of the United Sky West Regional Jet scraped the ground on runway 24 left around 8.23 a.m. after its left landing gear failed to fully deploy. This is one of the landing failures at LAX in 2015. What do you think about this kind of natural disasters? Do not forget to subscribe, like and comment here. Thanks for watching.